How this crazy surgeon and medical researcher was so controversial in his time that he was often labeled as crazy and dangerous. First, William Coley's treatments were very different from the standard treatments of the time. He injected patients with live bacteria, which was seen as a risky and dangerous practice. Additionally, Coley's treatments were not always successful, and some patients died as a result. Another reason for Coley's critics was that he was not a traditional medical researcher. He did not have a medical degree, and he did not publish his work in peer-reviewed journals. Instead, he shared his findings through lectures and pamphlets. Despite the criticism, Coley continued to work and treated around 1,000 cancer patients by injecting Coley's toxin. Coley's work eventually gained acceptance, and immunotherapy is now a standard treatment for cancer. However, he was never fully vindicated for his work, and he died in 1936 with the reputation of a quack.